Hello, welcome friend, my name is Annika. Last week I talked about that I wanted to do a video about my style for this week, but as you can tell, I that didn't happen. I've started the planning for that, but I haven't moved further, but I'm still making it, but it might take a little longer than expected but it will be happening so instead you're getting this little ACO that I did not make and it's actually the one that started my ACO streak that I've been on lately and yeah it's a lot of fun and if you want to see the ones that I make I do suggest that you follow me on Instagram I've been posting almost every day and I've been very productive this past week it feels great and I've actually posted many of them on my Etsy store so if you want to buy some they're on there and I actually sometimes post <laughs> the ACO on Etsy before I post it on Instagram because uh, I sometimes I do more than one a day but I I don't want to annoy people so I <laughs> I kind of just limit myself to one ACO a day on Instagram, so that way I can post things even on days where I don't have time to do one, so it's been working out really good. And as a result, sometimes I do post original on Etsy first, so you might be able to snag it before it goes live anywhere else. Yeah, so now back to this little lady so she's not really that special but she was one of the sketches for one of the giveaway winners from my last giveaway uh, the sketches that i did for her is aco the ones that she didn't want i did end up doing as acos anyway because i liked all of them so i i have done most of them or all uh, yeah so I did that so there were, were a lot of dragonflies because that was one of the things that she mentioned that she liked and um, I quite enjoyed doing dragonflies so there might be more in the future but yeah so it was a lot of fun and I did her on tan paper with Copic markers I also used colored pencils and my white gel pen and also my pencil pocket brush in some places and a fine liner. I actually also used my fine tech pearl color things. <laughs> I'm actually not sure how they are. They are like watercolors but they're gold. But I actually used the sterling silver on this one. But the person that I took note uh, of them was Ellen Wilberg. She's a new Norwegian lady who is really talented and uh, I really do suggest that you check her out. I will leave a link in the description or uh, she's Ellen Wilberg Art. She bought some last year and I really was very tempted to buy them then but I didn't so because I didn't know where to get them and then Sequems did her piece uh, and I really love the way it looked but I didn't have the money at the time so and I didn't know where to get them because uh, they were out of stock on the places where I looked and then Bailey J got them and I I thought man I need those <laughs> so I actually found a calligraphy, calligraphy store in the UK that sold them and the shipping wasn't that bad so I finally got them and yeah I really do enjoy them and I will link to the place where I got them below if I can find them again so Ellen was the first person where I saw them Sequems kind of got me <laughs> hooked and Bailey uh, made me take the plunge so I will link to all of them in the description so check them out yeah I've been using them on a lot of ACOs. This week I've actually done a, quite a few little princesses, so that's fun. So I've been using it on crowns and jewelries and dresses and such. I haven't used them on larger things in the pieces, uh, just small. 
And for this one I do use a sterling, sterling silver on the dragonfly wings. And I try to show how it shimmers in the video, but I'm, yeah, it's kind of hard to show. It's much more visible and more pretty in real life, but I tried. Uh, so, next week you're getting a sketchbook video, and it's of my first from this year. And uh, it's actually a sketchbook this time also, so that's exciting. And um, I'm really looking forward to showing you it, because there's a lot of cool things in it. But I will still be working on my style video, so that will be coming soon. But I don't think I will have time to work much on it this week. But I will do my best to still get it done. But as I said, a sketchbook video is expected next week so I hope you're looking forward to that and if you haven't already I suggest that you subscribe so that you don't miss it. That's it so thank you very much for watching. Hello!